Right, hello again everyone. As promised, here's the um, second video to the Hellgast Edition unboxing. Um, the Hellgast Edition of Killzone 3 isn't going to feature in this video. Um, but as you can see, what is going to feature is the PlayStation Move Sharpshooter Peripheral. Um, I obviously bought this to play Killzone 3. Um, basically, you input your Move controller and your Nav controller and play the game with the Move features. Um, which, while I was playing a demo without this, was good. So I'm really intrigued to see how the game is um, with the sharpshooter. So I'm just going to do a quick unboxing to show you what it is. Um, yeah, I picked this up from HMV um, today with the game. This was thirty nine ninety nine, um, which I thought could be cheaper, but as the buttons and the triggers are all digitally mapped to the move, I thought the technology inside is probably why. Price it's like it is like you probably get some cheap ones and you have to press the buttons yourself and the trigger won't work and stuff like that. So yeah, this is a this is the official Sony one. Sony made this, this is their thing, so I imagine it works very well, just like all Sony's products. So, yeah. so inside the box you get another box. Who doesn't like multiple boxes? PlayStation Move Sharpshooter. Voila. What else we got? So there's the gun itself. Come back to that in a sec. Um, literally, all you get with it is a manual. Now, one thing I would like to note is the US version is grey and it has an orange part here. Um, so the UK version is different. It's all red. I prefer the red, to be honest. Um, one thing I am slightly disappointed about is that we don't get no stickers like Killzone 3 stickers or Sockham Sockham 4 sorry stickers um, would have liked to have the Killzone stickers obviously put on it but it's not the end of the world I suppose I'll get them on eBay um, so yeah here's the sharpshooter gun I'm just trying to pan this about so you can see it if this YouTube thing goes well for me which you guys can make you can make that happen for me, I will invest in a proper camera and do some better videos, so yeah hopefully that ain't too bad for you guys so as you can see here it's got a trigger obviously we've got a lock switch and what that does is when you unlock it there's a move button so you press that on Killzone 3 to crouch behind cover so normally you'd have to press it there won't you, but because it's all digitally mapped Nah, not in the sharpshooter, baby. Just pop up, get into cover, shoot. Then obviously the move will be here, and you pull up your sights, and your movement here, and literally just move left to right, up and down to navigate on the screen. See, so, yeah, I'm feeling this red colour, you know. I'm actually glad we got the red one, because grey one looks a bit boring and stuff. So, I mean, I can customise it if I want to paint it or whatever, but I'm not going to, because it looks good. Um, here we have... An extension, so obviously you can put it down. Oh, get it nice and comfortable under your shoulder there. Um, I believe there's a lock for this somewhere. Yep, yeah, there's a lock just there for that, and you close that there. Uh, if you're left-handed, don't worry, you've got buttons there. Square and triangle, and righties like me, square and triangle. Uh, you can change to single burst, semi-automatic, automatic. Unlock this part there, put your move in, and you're now there. So that's a quick little look at the sharpshooter. Um, let you guys know what I think. And um, hopefully show you in action if my friend can film that for me. So yeah, there's a PlayStation Move sharpshooter gun. Highly recommend it if you've got move for this game. I'd imagine it's going to be brilliant. So I'll let you guys know. Cheers.